we've all received suspicious emails. This one offering free COVID-19 testing, if only the user downloads an attachment. It's a trap designed to infect the computer with TrickBot, malicious code used for digital theft and fraud, and to turn your computer against others. It is to steal your information, but it's also to weaponize your device, and you will have no idea that your device is being used in these types of attacks. Microsoft noticed its code was being used by cyber criminals and got the TrickBot network shut down. The timing is no coincidence. As Americans go to the polls, keen to avoid a repeat of the 2016 fiasco, when Russian hackers gained access to U.S. voter registration databases. We've secured systems, we've exercised, we've trained, we have incident response plans in place. We're ready for just about anything. Easier said than done, with private firms and government agencies now frequently targeted using ransomware, locking computers and displaying messages like this until victims pay a fee. And ransomware attacks on the U.S. public sector are happening at a rate of about eight per month. Last year, three Ontario hospitals fell victim, forcing staff to jot down patient information the cumbersome, old-fashioned way. When this hospital in Germany was hit with ransomware last month, it was forced to turn away patients, and one woman died highlighting the real risk of virtual attacks, which have only increased during the pandemic. You take one down and it seems that more just keep popping up. Security starts by avoiding those attachments. If the email looks suspicious, just hit delete. Thomas Dagg, CBC News, Toronto.